Hi everyone, my name is Alexis and I'm going to be talking to you about the effects of exercise on cancer patients. The cancer treatments that are supposed to kill cancer cells come with many toxic side effects, but I wanted to figure out if these side effects could be avoided with the application of exercise. Turns out there was already plenty of research on this topic and even modifiable behaviors that have been accounted for more than 20% of cancer, case, cancer cases. The US Department of Health and Human Services produced guidelines that are beneficial for not only cancer patients, but everyone. These guidelines specifically focused on adopting, adopting a physically active lifestyle, consuming a healthy diet with emphasis on plant-based foods, and limit of alcohol consumption. The question on if it's safe to exercise when receiving cancer treatments is a common concern, but the American College of Sports Medicine actually recommends exercise and states that inactivity should be avoided. These specific guidelines state that 150 minutes of aerobic exercise per week with two days of resistance training is highly recommended. Resistance training is effective for allowing regulation of muscular regeneration. Exercise during and following treatment have been associated with reductions in reoccurrences of cancer and mortality. Cancer survivors who exercise have, redu have reported reduced fatigue, improved quality of life, improved physical function, and improved body composition. Lastly, what's most important is that healthcare specialists provide their patients with the training and tools needed and proving to them that exercise will improve their outcomes and overall quality of life. 80% of oncology care providers are unaware of exercise guidelines and report a lack of knowledge about them and when to implement them. This needs to change. Thank you.